2K8, the away team, battle the Missouri-Kansas City Kangaroos. Welcome to the championship game of the conference tournament. We're here at the Alltel Arena in North Little Rock, Arkansas. This is Vern Lundquist with Bill Raftery and Tracy Wilson. What do you think, Bill? This game features a great matchup at the point guard position. Finley is a fantastic player. I love his offensive awareness. He knows how to manipulate defenders and really gets in their heads. Coppenrath can also hold his own at the point. He is an absolute load to handle in the post. You can't push him around. They're both ready to go. We'll see which of the two can lead their team to victory. and we'll get this one started. The game has just begun and they're already in the middle. Skips it to the left side. Finley. Hopes free, but it's tracked down by Missouri, Kansas City. Passes it to the left. Sim hatches it left wing. Feeds right wing. Great. No good from downtown. And it's still knotted up. Zero. Takes it up. Right into the corner with the dish. And it's slammed by Kuppenman. And they're now up by two. Let's check in with our sideline reporter, Tracy Wilson, who has some info for us. Well, just before the game, I talked to the Kangaroos coach. This is a moment he is sure his players have been dreaming about since November. And he admitted that he had been, too. He said he's already got the spot in the trophy case cleared out for the championship prize. He might be getting doing? a little ahead of himself, but he seemed awfully proud of what they'd already done this season. Thank you, Tracy. Right around six minutes left in the half. Swing it back out, swing it back out. Craven. Knocks it loose. And it's gathered up by Rivea. The intercept. What great interception. Counts in and picked that one off easily. Finley brings it up for From downtown, Rodeo gets the rebound. He'll want another shot with that much space. He knows he can make it. Catches it, top of the key. Cup and wrap, dishes it to the right block. No good. By Charles. Clayton inbounds the ball. Misses the long one. Verdeo went after that rebound hard. Great work. Close out. Verdeo gets it top of the key. What a pass. Bounce pass inside. Under five minutes left in the half. Leads him with the pass. The steal by the away team. Wonderful job of behind the basketball that time. Great pick. Nice little crossover. Logie to end that drive. by far. Goes up. Draws the foul and he'll get a trip to the line. Free the 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 Them both. 
just over four minutes left in the half. Sim picks it up. He gets hammered, and he'll head to the score. Tosses it up court. Right wing. Dishes to the strike. Sims releases from 16 feet. They narrow the gap to two. They're playing a 3 2 zone. Your big men have to be alert when they come out in this deep. Aaron Lashaw, right hop and round. The Kangaroos. A score here will knot it up. And you missed that shot wide. Getting set to inbound the ball. Stevenson inbounds the ball. By yourself, by yourself. Cup and wrap dumps it off. Just over three minutes left in the half. Leads him with the pass. They're in the lead. Thanks for the basket. And the lead. The Kangaroos looking to extend their run. Hoppin' Rock gets the reach in foul, and that's his first foul of the game. Great to see him, of course. Wants to shake things up just a little bit, and this could be an excellent move. The group of kids on the floor play with great chemistry. By yourself, by yourself. Sim gets it far side. The crossover. Let's get back to the action. The away team all his time. Well, it looks like they're getting set to inbound the ball. Verdeo inbounds the ball. Picks it up. It's <laughs> Let's it up. Hands the open. Finley. They push their lead to five. Passy to the free throw line. Mansoura. Brandon, thank you. 
250 left in the first half. Fry passes it to the free throw line. Turner holds it in. Yeah, minutes That's remaining. his third rebound Two of the contest. Minutes. How did he miss that one? It happens. He's just got to shake it off by and reload. Verdeo hands it off. Throws it up. Pulled in by Murphy. Murphy with a great offensive yeah. rebound. He worked so hard to establish position. But they're still behind by one. Right wing. Dishes it to the free throw line. Finley releases from 16 feet. Hits the left rim and out. But they're still out in front by one. Last basket to us. Unless so What did you mean? Not too many guys can use the finger roll anymore, but he does it with style. Logie. Swing pass. Right wing. Logie gets it right wing. Fly dumps it off. Nice pass. Releases. The triple was off the mark by Finn. Time and time again, he comes up with the big four. You need to be able to ride the big guys because without solid rebounding, everything else can fall apart. Tony inbounds the ball. Here's a 3 2 zone with Benjamin Pixels. This is the end on offense for this one. Missouri, Kansas City is really struggling to close down the middle. Tracy has something for us. Tracy? Yeah, the on the bench, we have to be more physical in the paint. Don't be afraid of some contact. Sounds like he'd rather have some fouls called than to keep giving up all those easy baskets. Thanks, Tracy. Sutton, way up there. Mansour shoots it. No luck. First half comes to an end with the score 17 to 15. Give us your opinion on the first half, Bill. This has really been tooth and nail. Nobody wants to see a blowout burn, and it doesn't look like it's going to happen. And now it's time to show you our player of the half. Bill Finley has been an intimidator out there. He has impressed me not only with his ability to create offense for himself, but for his ability to change the opponent's offensive game plan. He's been a true asset at both ends of the court. Solid performance from our player of the half. John Morris needs to get involved. Because he has five rebounds with no points. Fideo has five points. I mean five. Fideo <laughs> has five rebounds with no points. He needs to be involved. I don't know what Stevenson's doing. But that's just me. Yeah, everybody is involved except for Stevenson. Oh, but keep up the good work. And our offense is harmless in the paint. Our offense is not doing offensive things because it's not offense. That's the result. We're all set to begin the second half. Stevenson inbounds it to start the second half. Mansura goes up. Gets the nice one. And it's now all knotted up. Now let's go down to Tracy Wilson, who has an update for us. Thanks, Vern. During halftime, I spoke with the head coach. Bernie told me that he was going to do just the opposite of what they would expect, hoping to catch them off guard. Coach went on to say that he was going to break all the conventional wisdom and blaze his own fat this game. We can expect to see some strange practices coming up, guys. Well done, Tracy. Thank you. Last attempt off the mark. I'm going to show it.
cross court. Lead pass to the right. Mansoor has had some difficulties. Takes it up. Hogan wipes the board off the window. Credit to D there. They reacted quickly enough to throw him off. Finley. Rebeo pulls it in. Still a two-point lead. Mansuris has it high post. Almost a three-point opportunity. Sims. Fouled hard there. Good back to Fisher. tie game. This is right wing. Coger catches it. Baseline with the shot. Rebounded by Murphy. And that's his fourth rebound thus far. Leads him in. Great job to swarm the jump shooter on that play. That's how you lock the man up. Coger inbounds the ball. Missouri Kansas City will take its first time out. on the defensive end. Sims skips it to the right. Down low. Out of bounds. Oh. Touch last by Missouri, Kansas City. Both teams have only shake things up a little bit with some subs. Well, Brian, hopefully you won't have any mobility problems with that injury. Chalmer inbounds the ball. Just over four minutes left in the second half. Passes back down low. Takes the shot. The quick shot is missed by Seth. But they're still up by two. Sim pulls the trigger. Can't connect from long range. With nobody around, he still couldn't convert. Sometimes he's wide open. That last basket was buried by Seth. The kangaroo for all time out. Substitution on the court. Both teams are making a few lineup changes. Court. Coger inbounds the ball. Dishes to the left block. Snatched off the defensive glass by Stevenson. The visitors still hold a narrow lead. 
The D served it up to him, and he still doesn't sink it. Okay. Finley gets it high post. Pass. Sosa corrals the miss. Sosa didn't get that rebound by accident. He knew right where to be. Craven. Has it on the strike. Sims lets it go. Hogan snatches the offensive rebound. Again, apparently nobody learned how to rebound. Shoots. He misses the third season. So didn't sit for long and he's coming back into the ball game. Feeds it to the left wing. Monsuris bounces it to the right side. Verdeo catches it. Left wing. Pass. Left side. Puts it up. The shot. Right on the floor. The Kangaroos. All time. They're losing by seven. 2.30 left in the game. They're getting set to inbound the ball. Craven inbounds the ball. Sim picks it up. Got a handoff. He'll have to shoot his thing twice after that block. The kid comes out of nowhere to make some. He got a foul. That's his first personal foul. Third team foul. Shooting two. Sink the first. And sinks the second. Missouri Kansas City falls timeout. They're down by eight. Two thirteen left in the game. Set to inbound the ball. Koger inbounds the ball. The steal by the away team. I'd love to see that. He's looking for the Such a deep ball. He makes a man. Has it right wing. Craven pushes it to the strike. Oh, three. And it's scooped up by Charlie. But he tried to sell the shot. Charlie beat his alert and didn't buy. Good steal. Listen to the crowd burn. This kind of excitement is why I love college basketball. Anticipates the pass. The Bayo passes it up court. The D was really waiting for him there. That's how you do it. Keep the heat on. Wait for the misstep and then capitalize. Sims to put an end to the run. Stevenson reels it in. The visitors should look to use some clock here. It would take a miracle to avoid a loss at this point. You simply can't give away points down the stretch and hope to make them back up. Throws it up. Yank down inside by Kogler. Goes up. Phenomenal hops. Help him get a lot of shots. He was like three instincts. A nose for the ball. And a feel for maybe the shooter's release ball. Passes to left wing. Monsura. Chong gets it on the elbow. Passes far side. Chalmers unloads. 
Stevenson snatches it down inside. The last layup, no good. I don't think they can come back. There's too far to climb and too short a time. The visitor and this game pretty much to the ball. Sosa inbounds the ball. They should hold on to the lead, Vern. If they play smart, they can walk away with the win. The Kangaroos will get this one back. Right wing tosses it up. Misses it. The visitors knock off Missouri, Kansas City, 38 to 24. They're conference champions. And now it's time to show you our player of the game. Now let's go to Greg Gumbel back in the studio for today's Pontiac game-changing performance. Thanks, Vern. Welcome, everyone, to the 2K Sports Studios. I'm Greg Gumbel, and we're set to bring you the Pontiac game-changing performance. It's no secret that getting momentum on your side is one of the keys to winning basketball games. Davian, what's Off good with you, bro? Hope everything's going good. On this play right here. This sparked the run that simply broke the back of the opposition. Thank you, Greg. This is Vern Lundquist for Tracy Wolfson and Bill Raftery. We hope you enjoyed this presentation of College Hoops on 2K Sports.